So, welcome to my group's poison lab. What's your name? My name is Javier Camby, and I'm in the Minecraft at the Museum program. Where should we go first? So, we should go to the bookcase first. So, this is basically a library of all of the poison books we managed to find and create. It explains like real poisons, Minecraft poisons, and what they do and their cure. And over there is our library of all the poisons we were able to find physically. Each of them is shown if we can find them in real life or in Minecraft. Like the raw fish, it's both in Minecraft and in real life. And can you give us a few other examples? And the apple. The apple could be poisonous in real life because of the core. The seeds have cyanide in them. I believe that's what it is. Cyanide? Yeah. yeah. But in Minecraft, you eat it and nothing happens to you. And the rotten flesh. That's on the left, right? Yeah. Yeah. So in Minecraft, if you eat it, I heard, because I've never eaten it before, it's poisonous, but like in real life, you wouldn't really eat a rotting flesh. Is that zombie flesh? I think it is. I think it's zombie, okay. So, so what yeah. else do we have here? So over there, like that that floating book, is our experiment to see, to create magic. Magic was actually real, and we were able to create it. It's real where? It, the enchanting table. Oh, it's real in Minecraft. Uh -huh. Yeah. And what's over here? That is our microscope. And what's the microscope for? Like to analyze our poisons and stuff. So we have science next to magic. Yeah, and that the that's our cloning table chamber that doesn't really exist. Okay, and why is there TNT over here? To destroy any evidence of our research. Ah, uh, because this is hidden underwater. Yeah. Okay. So you ask why? To avoid any problems with the government. With the government, it's okay. Yeah. I don't know why the government doesn't want us to know about poison, but okay. And um, what inspired you guys to make this? What did you use to well, learn? Well, we had like uh, an assignment to do during our Minecraft, um, during our Minecraft session to make, because we went to the poison museum exhibit thing, and we had to construct something based off of it, off of it. And since we didn't have enough time, we just you didn't have like time to build a giant frog, like, or build a machine. You just built this giant <clears throat> underground lab. Well, what kind of things would you want people to learn who might visit it? Like what poisons act like <clears throat> in the picture things behind you. We want we would want them to look at them and and find out what poisons are real and what's not, and what can cause like actual poison in Minecraft and real life and differ between the two worlds.